Hi students, welcome to our next session. In the next session, our topic is long and short in comparisons. Today, our topic is long and short. Long and short. Long and short. In comparisons, this is our third topic. So, let's we see. Let's we discuss about it. So, third topic is long. Read with me L O and G. Long. L O and G. Long. Pronounce like this. Long. L O and G. Long. And next, short. S H O R T. Short. S H O R T. Short. L O N G. Long. S H O R T. Short. Okay, children. Let's we discuss this topic. Mostly we are using the long and short things in daily in our life. In our life we are using all. See the belt. For example, take your belt. Take your belt, school belt. See it and compare with your father's belt. Your father also keeping one belt, no? So take your father's belt and your school belt both join together then you can find your belt is too short compared to your father's ones your belt is too small compared to your father ones see children i have long hair see here my hair is too long my hair is too long watch out your hair Boys always have short hair and even girls also. See, compare your hair with me. Your hair is too long like this. No, your hair is too short. No, so long and short. Long hair, short hair. Long hair, short hair. So here we will go to, go, we will go with few more examples what are those here I'm drawing see the ribbon the ribbon it is too long see the ribbon the ribbon is long see another one here this ribbon is too small so short compared to these two this one is long this one is short. One more example. In front of your house, you have a road where you will drive your vehicles. Right? See. The road. Find out that in front of your home, you have a road and when you are coming to the school, you saw a long road also. So, compare the boat. Which road is long and which road is small? Always leave in front of your home that road is short compared to the highway or which road you are using to go to your school. So these two are short, long and short. So one more time repeat with me the spelling long L O N G long again children L O N G long S H O R T short short means the small small size compared to the 
long one so here are two examples we have few more examples also here see the branches on trees see see these two branches compared to this branch this branch is too short this branch is long see these two children this one we call branch so watch out these two branches which one is long this one is long this branch is long this branch is short so children go outside check out in your garden that long trees and the short trees long plants and the short bushes find out them and picture out that and paste it in your notebook here we have few more examples see these two pencils compared to these two this pencil is long one more time long this pencil is long this one short so repeat the spelling l o n g long s h o r t short s h o r t short so here are the examples related to our topic long and short in the comparisons comparisons we have to compare two things so here find out the things which are long and which are short at your home in your school in your bag see watch out your backpack in your backpack you have so many pencils so find out how many are long and how many are short in your school also you have so many things the benches which one is long and which one is short in your home your mother and you have that hey you no know, in that hey whose hair is long and whose hair is short watch out it and find out them so comparisons in between two things we have to compare two things so in the two things two or more things we will compare so in that comparison we can find out which one is long and which one is short correct children next here we will go over topic in our textbook in our textbook also we have so many examples and with beautiful pictures which will attract you more so here we go see here children see here see here two animals are there you know these animals do you know these animals see here children what is this animal see this what is this animal this one is monkey this one is monkey and see down another animal is there what is this animal this animal is goat this animal is goat so these two are the animals here see the children the animals have tails the animals have tails so watch out the monkey tail the monkey have long tail the monkey have long tail the monkey have long tail and here the goat have that short tail the goat have short tail so we will go with this through this textbook and we will do a small work also worksheet which was given in the back side of our text i will explain one and you have to do the remaining one so try to do this one so all the best see here listen see here here one small exercise you have see in this textbook see here color the long one with blue 
and color the short one with orange orange short one we have to color with orange and long one we will color with blue so here we have two pencils here we have two pencils which we have to see either it is big or small you have to find out so here see the children see here which one is the long this one is the long pencil so here see the picture and find out which one is long so take the blue color and color the long pencil take the blue color and color the long one next orange take orange one and fill the short pencil orange one for short objects so which objects are small or short which objects are short for those you have to fill them with orange so better yourself do your work and do these two and these remaining two you have to done without any help i know that you all understood this topic very well so you can do this one easily thank you children this is the session in comparison long and short then let's meet in another session bye